Governor Brown will get a look at the Woolsey fire devastation today as victims look toward rebuilding. CBS 2's Candace Crone is live in Oak Park with more on the very difficult road ahead. Candace. Yeah, Peter, the governor will be in town in just a couple of hours, and when he arrives, this is what he'll see. Home after home just burned to the ground, people's livelihoods essentially reduced to rubble. We have some more video of the destruction that he'll survey along with the U.S. Secretary of the Interior and other state and local officials. Governor Brown will also hold a news conference later this morning. Well, during a tour of the fire-ravaged areas in Northern California on Sunday, he called the current wildfires, quote, California's new normal, and said we're in for very difficult times. Meantime, homeowners who lost everything are just trying to figure out how to rebuild. We've got some video from a community meeting last night where residents from across Ventura we County who suffered losses from the fire attended a town hall meeting for updates on resources and services that are available to them from state and local agencies. And I just spoke to a man whose home was burned down on this street where we are here on Wembley Drive. He welcomes the governor's visit and hopes there's tight oversight of insurance companies. Insurance companies are picking and choosing who gets to win or lose and then, you know, don't provide adequate coverage. So I believe there should be an executive order to hold insurance companies accountable. And after touring the damage, the governor will then attend the funeral for Sergeant Ron Helis. He was killed responding to the mass shooting at Borderline Club in Thousand Oaks. He'll be in attendance to show his support for the family.